Oh, ma'am. Good morning, y'all. Happy Saturday. I'm starting the vlog a little bit late. It's been crazy. Thursday and Friday, I just put lotion on my legs and the cat's licking it. No, ma'am. Thursday and Friday, I sat in front of a computer all day long. And then today, I'm filming and I'll be doing the same thing because I'm going out of town to Chic Soul, of all places. I feel like I travel there pretty often. Um, so I'm going out of town next week and I'm just trying to make sure everything's ready. <laughs> that I have stuff for y'all to watch while I'm gone or I can take it with me and edit while I'm gone. So I'm making me some breakfast this morning. The usual bacon and maybe some oatmeal. I feel like that's what I've been enjoying lately. Always coffee. Always, always coffee. Um, so on tap for today, like I mentioned, filming. I took a shower, shaved, exfoliated, did all that business because I need to fake tan tomorrow. So we're gonna do that. Um, what else? I feel like it's just been a little bit wild in my life recently. Um, but I feel like last week's vlog was fun. We actually did some things, like went to a photo shoot. We had Mother's Day. Um, so this will also be fun. I am filming a like day in the life of a model one day while I'm gone for their YouTube channel. So you won't see that here. But once I find out when it's going to go live for them, I will put that info down below. But we always have so much fun when I'm filming there. So I'm excited. Oh, the swimsuit video. I'm filming a swimsuit video today. It's a it's an extra for the week. So it'll go live on Wednesday. So that's already up. By the time you're watching this, I'll link it down below. And then I have another extra video for next Wednesday. So for the next two weeks, you'll get four videos. How exciting. We had to buy a new faucet. This one, like the water pressure, there's something caught in it. Brian says he can't get to it to get it out. So we went last night and bought a new one. And here it is. I like it because it's taller than the other one. So you can actually fit like big pots and pans and stuff down there. So he's gonna install that for us tomorrow. That'll be exciting. Come on. There we go. I need to see today if I can find, I just did skincare, I'm shiny. These, so I took this whole thing or the other one, this is the second one. The first one I had, I took it with me last time and someone commented that you can buy little to-go packs. So I'm gonna look online and see if anywhere in my town has them. And I need to get some of those today. Um, I need to figure out my water situation. We know I like to drink a lot of water, um, but I'm gonna be in a hotel. So do I take the water with me and then put it in the fridge? Or do I just like buy it when I get there? Original oatmeal. Remember I tried the peaches and cream one last week? It was pretty good. Um, the original is just my favorite. And then I add a little bit of cinnamon sugar. And just like that, we have oatmeal. And then I always make enough bacon to eat for multiple days because it's just easier than doing that every single day. But honestly, it only took me like 10 minutes. And then I made my coffee with my collagen powder. So I'm gonna eat breakfast. Um, I did my taxes the other day. I don't think I've, I've talked about it with y'all, but like that made me so nervous because last year when I did them, I worked full time as a news reporter, we know this, but I also did YouTube stuff and I had to pay so much money in taxes. So this year I was like, let's just prepare for it, it's happening. And it really wasn't as bad as I thought it could be. It could be a lot worse, you know what I mean? It could be better, but I'm not too upset about it. It's like, hey, we need a leg versus, hey, we need both of your legs. You know what I mean? <laughs> what I was here to tell you the whole time, I knew there was something. So Brian, the other, I'm gonna put you here while I eat my breakfast. Oh, you can't, you can't even see me down there. So Brian, the other day, surprised me with a trip to Disney. I'm so excited. We're not Disney people whatsoever, but I was gonna go with my sister and her family in August and they're not able to go. And so Brian and I were talking about it one day and he was like, I haven't been to Disney in like 20, 30 years or something crazy like that. He's like, yeah, I'd like to go and just see what it's like. And then he planned it. And so it's like been so exciting because he picked, you know, all the things that we'll do. Like he actually planned what we're gonna do while we're there. And I don't know, I'm so excited. So we're gonna go in a couple of months. So that'll be fun. Like I mentioned, we're not Disney people, but I feel like everybody is a little bit Disney. You know what I mean? Like it's just a fun thing to do and we don't have kids. So I feel like it's gonna be even more fun for us 
because we can come and go as we please. We can do what we want to do. You know, we're going to Disney as adults and I think it'll be fun. So I'm excited for that. So be prepared for me to talk about that pretty often until it happens. I Googled like outfits to wear at Disney. Like I don't know what to do. Like I live in the South. It's hot as Hades. So I know that it's going to be hot there, but it's just, you know, I'm excited. So I'm going to eat breakfast now and then get ready. And then I'll see you later. My brother-in-law power washed all this for us. There I am. Hello. That's just like excess dirt, but it looks so much better. I'll put a picture here of like side by side when some was power washed and some wasn't. It just looks so nice. So he did all the pavers. I can't show you everything, but he did all the sidewalk around the pool under here. It just looks so nice. Breakfast was good. I chugged that coffee a little bit too fast. Now I'm going to sit outside with Cash, get ready, do my day. I want to grill out hamburgers tonight. So we'll do that. <laughs> Are you okay? Okay, 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 okay. And go. Come on. Go. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. She got me. Guess we gotta take a pee break. Change of plans for dinner. We're doing Joe's Pizza. Brian just walked in. That's him right there <laughs> to pick it up. Uh, we ordered, their pizzas are huge. Y'all know this. So we just order one and do like half and half of what we want. So we did extra cheese on all of it. Half pepperoni for me, half mushroom for him. They also have like a quattro cheese kind of pizza that's good, but well, you can't buy a pizza. They only make it by the slice and they rarely have it. So if they have a slice in there, it'd be very nice of him. I see him pointing at something. Maybe he's grabbing me a slice. Um, I worked, filmed my video. I just took all my makeup off when he called and said, hey, do you want to go have dinner somewhere? And I was like, listen, I'm not trying to put makeup back on my face. So we're not going to do that. Uh, I'll show you the pizza per usual. And then uh, tomorrow is a packing and busy kind of day. It must not be ready yet. He's coming back out. What is all that? Um, well, there's the pizza, and then there's, oh, those are meatballs. You got and meatballs? Then, yep. And then that's a ah, slice of yes. the for the bee. I was telling the vlog. And then this is a calzone. Canole calzone. We've never Canole tried Canole the meatballs. Canole. Yeah, they're, they're freaking. Have you? Yeah. Oh. Y'all. Happy Monday, y'all. Um, okay, so I am actually sitting in line at a Chick-fil-A in Auburn. I'm pretty sure I told you I was going out of town this week. Yes, I remember talking about it. So I'm here. Um, I'm early. So I figured I should probably grab a little something to eat because if not, I don't get to eat again till tonight and I'm very hungry. It's 12, 25, 12 30. I have to be there at one, which I'm three minutes down the road. Um, but I was purposely early like left early this morning because I'm going to wear fake lashes <laughs> and we know I've been like trying to work it out where I can do the fake lashes I feel like I do them pretty good but it made me nervous to think about wearing them for you know hours while I drive um so I figured I'd come a little bit early so I could put them on can I get um an eight count nugget meal with okay. a diet coke with light ice okay. all right I had my chick-fil-a nuggets I'm gonna put lashes on. I have the Ardell Natural. I bought them in a five pack. And then I bought this separate, this Eyelore Lash Glue, the clear one. I don't know, I've probably heard somebody talk about it and they said great things. I do like it, don't get me wrong. I like it, I have no complaints. I don't really have anything to compare it to. So, but I do like it, they stay put. I did like a wear test for a lot. I can't talk while I do it. So let me put it on while you watch me struggle. Oh no, I might have to redo this one already. I was just bragging on myself saying how good I, oh, maybe not, maybe not. 
Okay. I struggle with this eye because it's the only eye I can see out of. <laughs> so like, I'm like working on the eye that I'm like looking out of. So it's kind of hard. I do have some mascara as well to throw on to like blend the two together, okay? Not too shabby. This one got bent a little bit in transport. I don't have any scissors on me to like cut a new pair because they're too long. What time is it? 12.46? I'm in the parking lot. I didn't park like facing the windows so that they could watch me struggle while I put on fake lashes. So I'm going to put this one on and then we'll be back. Okay, this one, the one with the eye that I can't see out of that's easy, went on so easy. This one, not so much. So here's what they look like. They're a little bit uneven, I feel like. But you know what? I just put lashes on in my car. I'm very proud of myself. So, okay. I'm gonna go in, it's 12.50. I'll, I'll put lipstick on when I get in because I have to wear a mask. Um, but I'll see you whenever we get done tonight. Okay, we are done for the, for the day. It's 4.55. I've got my air blasting. It is so hot outside. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I want to go. I ran out of the Kerastase hair serum that I love. So we're going to run to Ulta and hopefully they have it in stock. Um, and then head to the hotel room because I want to take a shower and just relax. There's not very many people in the parking lot, so I hope it's open. This is the first time I've ever been to this Ulta. I'm pretty sure it is anyways. Okay, they don't sell it here. So I'm gonna see if I can find something else in its place. Everything I see is for like damp hair. I need like dry hair. Just something nice, moisturizing to put in my hair. So this one is a leave-in. It says wet or dry hair. It says spray the pr product on wet or dry hair as a leave-in. Okay, okay. I like this brand. Okay, so they don't sell Kerastase. We know that. You know how hard it is to find like a moisturizing oil slash product, I think you're about to fall, um, that you can put on dry hair. Everything says put on damp hair, except for I found this Kenra Platinum Silkening Gloss. It says you can put it on wet or dry hair. And then I also grabbed the moisturizing oil. It does say wet hair. Some people say you can put it on dry hair, but it says absorbs instantly and it's lightweight. So I feel like I can do the Silkening Gloss tonight, get a good coat of it on, and then in the morning do some of this oil just to help protect my hair. I spent $43.60. So the Silkening Gloss was 22 bucks. I didn't realize you were that close to me. And then the Moisturizing Oil was 18. So it's a little bit pricey, but I don't think I've ever tried a Kenra product before and people talk about that it's really good. So we'll try it when we get to the hotel tonight. Like once I wash my face and sort of settle down, we'll try it. Okay. Um, I got a sweet this time. <laughs> How nice is this? So. King bed with a TV, a little desk, which is nice because I brought my computer, can do some work, watch TV, a couch with another TV. Huh. Okay, this is nice. This is nice. Let's check the closet because I don't even know what I would do if someone was in there, honestly. I, what, what do you do? You just hope nobody's in there? Okay, so. Let me just check behind all the doors. Okay. Okay. All right. I think we're good to go. Okay. I just got out of the shower. This is the best thing where you get. I accidentally left my tripod in the car and I don't want to walk out there and get it. So let's try the Kenra Platinum Silkening Gloss. I haven't done anything to my hair since I got here. We we'll got back to the hotel except for put it up. We're gonna brush it through. It still looks pretty good. I did wash it this morning, by the way. Um, but I can feel it like it's already dry. 
I just put so much hairspray in it. Okay, so directions say, it's hard to read them. Like, I think they put it like on a mirror. I'm sitting on the toilet, like the lid is closed. So that's what's creaking. So it says massage two to three pumps in palms and smooth onto hair in sections. Apply more as needed, concentrating on ends. Apply heat for optimum shine results. Okay. Smells good. Okay, it is like oil based. I thought it would be like, oh, I didn't section my hair. You know what? I feel like that's fine. I got a lot of hair, so I think that we'll be okay. So I'm just going to finger comb it. I'm going to try to avoid a lot of the roots here just in case it causes like an oily look. It feels it's already gone. I'm going to do a little bit more. One more pump. I need to just order that Kerastase online so that I can go ahead and have it like on my way, on the way to me. Okay, that felt really, really nice. My hair does feel a little bit better. I'm tired, y'all. Can't you tell? I feel like I don't even... Like I'm not even making sense anymore. Okay, okay. This oil, it says non-greasy, touchable finish. Directions. Apply several drops into moisturizing shampoo and conditioner. Wash as normal for styling. Um, you can apply it to towel dried hair for finishing. That's what we want to do. Apply mid-length to ends to control flyaways and add a polished shine to any look. Do we want to just put some of this in here too? While we're here. Oh. Oh, okay. It says that it dries nice. It says mm. absorbs instantly. So we're going to focus on the ends because that's where a lot of my breakage happens. I'm using you for a mirror as well. So if I'm not like looking at you or like looking into the camera, it's because I'm looking at myself. Let's get these here. And these right here, and then maybe these right here. I mean, my hair looks better already. I just really want it right there too, but like I said, I don't want to mess up and have like oily roots. Okay, now let's brush it out. Can your products, people talk about them like they're gold? And like I said, I don't think I've tried any, but so far, oh, it feels nicer already. Yeah. I might put a little bit more. I have super thick hair, so just bear with me. And I wanna get it like this stuff all right in here. Cause that's where a lot of the hairspray and stuff goes because this is the Obviously, part that people see. Yeah. It looks good. Okay. I'm relatively pleased. I feel like it doesn't look as dry. I might do it again in the morning. Good morning, y'all. It's probably 8 a.m. I My call time is at 10, so I got to sleep in a little bit. I just woke up, did my skincare. So like I mentioned earlier in the vlog, I'm filming for their channel today. So I'm going to switch over to that video, but I will see you tonight. All right. We are wrapped for the day. I already took my lashes off <laughs> and then put my hair up. It's just hot today. My car says 91. So what I think I'm going to do, it's pretty early. It's only 3.30. So I think I may go back to Ulta and see if they have a good Kenra hair mask because I'm so impressed with those products. So impressed. Highly recommend. So I want to see if they have a hair mask. And then I didn't bring any shampoo and conditioner, so I may see if they have little travel sizes. I don't know. Do we want to do that tonight? I feel like we should. It's so early. So let's go back to Ulta. And we're back. So let's see if they have any good masks. So we have these two. This one says 29. I can't find the price for this one, but the anti-breakage might be 
the way to go. I don't see a mini like shampoo and conditioner. So let's go over. I like this Biolage. Let's see if they have a mini. Okay, this is what I want. Hydrosource shampoo. And we'll take, I think I have this color last conditioner at home. Yeah, so we're gonna do these two to wash tonight. But I'm gonna do this mask. I wonder if I need to put, hmm. I think this is the conditioner. I'm back from Ulta. So I was just gonna show you what I got. I did get this mask. It was, let's see, it was $20. So we're gonna try this tonight. And then it is like also a conditioner, so I didn't need a shampoo and a conditioner. So I just got this Biolage Hydrosource, it was five bucks. I use this shampoo, I have the big one at home. But then also in the little checkout area, you know, you know they get you with like all the products there and you pick them up as you wait to check out. I grabbed the Elemis Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm. I did a poll on my Instagram a while back asking if y'all liked this brand or the Clinique one better. And Alexis, who is also a Chic Soul model, messaged me and said she, this was like holy grail for her, transformed her skin. So I grabbed it, it was $14 for the mini, but we're gonna try this tonight. So like I mentioned earlier, it's still pretty early. So I'm just gonna relax for a little while. We are now in the bathroom. So let's see, wait, do I wet my face first? We're gonna do the cleansing balm. It hasn't been that long at all. I'm just excited <laughs> and I want to try it. And you know, like after you've been working all day, you're just ready to like take a shower, take your makeup off, wind down, find something good to watch on TV. I'm still trying to get this off. Okay. So here we go. Direction, smooth over and massage into face and neck. Remove with warm, damp cloth. If contact with eyes occurs, rinse thoroughly. You got it. Okay. It smells like a spa. It feels like put like Vaseline. Okay. Here we go. I have super sensitive skin. Well, more so when I was younger, actually. Like now that I'm a little bit older, it's getting to be better. Okay. I'm nervous for the eyes, but I watch people do it. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Oh gosh. We'll go gentle. Now I'm afraid to open my eyes. Get the eyebrows. Can I open my eyes? Oh gosh, y'all. Get in the hairline. All down here. I don't know why I'm talking through it. I think it just makes me feel better. Okay. That's what we're looking like. I should have turned the water on. Let's get the water going. Okay. I feel like I used too much. Like I could have gotten away with maybe a fraction of what we just used, which is good because it's not cheap. So if you can, you know, use less, Okay, it's wiping right off. Probably shouldn't have done this on a hotel towel when I have this literally sitting right here. Okay, well, you know what? It is what it is. I feel like it really got all of it off. Okay, now I'm just gonna wash my face. And here's the real test. We'll see if it got all of it off. I mean, there was still some on the towel, but those could have been places I didn't rub the balm. All right, okay, I'm happy. I'm gonna wait to do moisturizer because I'm gonna take a shower and we're gonna wash the hair. Okay, hold on a second. I was just trying to rinse this out. This is the side that I just wiped that had tons of makeup on it and I squirted some cleanser on it, rubbed it together and it's coming off. We're out of the shower. My hair doesn't really smell like anything. <laughs> Which, I don't know, maybe a good thing if you don't like 
scented thing. So I'm going to brush and then we're going to use the stuff I bought last night. Now for the oil. It comes out a little bit slow. That's okay. All right, so I'm gonna let my hair air dry tonight for the most part, unless it's, you know, time for me to go to sleep and I'm tired and it's still pretty wet, then I'll blow dry it. But I'm gonna try to just let it air dry. So, so far so good. I'll be able to tell you in the morning more about the hair mask, if it, you know, how it feels and stuff like that. So I'm gonna go find me something to watch on TV and I'll see you in the morning. Good morning, y'all. Let me turn this TV down and we'll do a little hair recap. So last night I did have to throw the blow dryer on it just a little bit because it was real, real wet before I went to bed. Um, and I will say I wasn't super impressed with it last night with the hair mask. The other products we know, highly recommend. I've already said that how many times. Um, my hair felt a little bit wiry after I blow dried it. Um, so actually my friend Jessica asked me about it and I was like, uh, don't really recommend it. Not for me. But this morning it's soft. I don't feel like it's as dry as it normally is. So I don't know. I mean, I like it. I don't want to say don't buy it because I feel like it did do some things to my hair. It's not my favorite. I still like that. Wella is the brand. It comes in a tub from Ulta, it's a hair mask. It smells like Play-Doh, but it works really, really well. I don't know how much it is. I don't remember. My sister got it for me as a gift, and then I repurchased it, but I don't remember because that was so long ago. So that one I do really like. Um, this one was nice as well. I'll continue to use it because I have it, and I do think that my hair needed something last night because again, like it was just so dry. So I'm happy that we did the wash and mask. I'm gonna do my makeup now. I just put my collagen powder and this coffee I got from the gas station a couple days ago. It's been in the fridge. So I'm gonna shake it, drink my coffee, do my makeup. And we're done, ready to check out. This is my outfit. I have all my things. Let's go. <gasps> oh no. Good thing I put that in a case. That's my laptop. Okay. While we're at the gas station, this is the one that sells the Dasani lemon waters. And I can't find them in mobile. Well, I can't find them in store. So I'm gonna go in and grab a bunch of them to take home with me. Let's go. Oh, they have strawberry too? Okay, we're gonna get a bunch of lemon. Maybe four, because I have to hold them, and then maybe a couple strawberry. Alright, $6.74. Six bucks, 74 cents. They were a dollar a piece. So I'm gonna wrap this up, put it in the floor here. I need these for today. I bet Brian will like those strawberry ones. The lemon ones, really good. But he's not a fan of like the Nestle lemon ones so he, but he may not he may like the dasani strawberry okay whew. i'm going in for my work day i'll see you when i'm done also this lash you can see it's not all the way down gave me trouble this morning i may need to fix it <laughs> when we get there Okay. All right. Okay. So that happened while I was gone. Oh, there she is. Hi. Hi. Pretty girl. I missed her too. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Let me make sure nobody's out here. Hang on a second. 
Back up. No, ma'am. Go on. Go potty. Obviously, I'm home. I, I rode with the windows down through town. Um, okay, so it's like 3.15. Not too bad. I need to edit you so that you can watch this. Um, you're actually getting this on Friday this week because tomorrow you're getting a fun like bonus swimsuit video. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.